What's up guys, it's Claudio from Visual Motor WordPress Teams and in today's video gonna learn how to create a contact form like this one with this Mode Options drop down menu. So the drop list menu that you can apply into your contact form 7 WordPress plugin for free without coding. This is what you're gonna learn into this video. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us because we bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, plugins, optimizations, and many, many more topics in our choose internet on a site's favor. So let's get this started. So this drop down menu list of options can be very, very useful in a lot of cases, okay? According to the contact form to collect users' information and receive those informations into your email for free. Let's get this started. Very first thing to do is navigate your WordPress dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus and hover your mouse over plugins and click on add new plugin submenu. Right here into the upper right corner of your screen next to the keyword, we're gonna be able to find a field called search plugins and right here we're gonna type contact form, just like this. And we're gonna be installing the first option right here, contact form seven. Here is the developer. Click on install now. After this, click into the activate button. This is gonna redirect you to the plugins list, a list where we can see all of the present plugins on your site, okay? But nothing to do right here. Review the left sidebar of menus once again. And next to comments, you're gonna be able to find a new menu called contact. Click on it. And from here, the plugin gonna gives you a new contact form automatically, call it contact form one. Here is the form. Let's apply this form into one of our pages, okay? So I'm gonna hover my mouse over page, click on add new page. But of course you can apply this into a previously made page in the case that you want. Let me apply a name for this page. I'm gonna click into this plus button to add widget and into the search field I'm gonna type contact. So we can search for contact form 7. I'm gonna select the contact form 1 that is the unique contact form that you have yet and I'm gonna click into the publish button to publish the page. Let's review our page. Now that we have our contact form, here we go, okay, we have e our name, email, subject, and message, and the submit button, okay, so we have five elements on our contact form. But where is our choose option menu, or drop down menu? How to apply this to a form? Go to the form editor, okay, so once again, go back to our WordPress dashboard, go to contact, click on contact form one. And here is what you see into the contact form. As I told you previously, we have five elements, okay? I would like to add, add a new element. I type enter. I would like to apply this between the email and the subject. So, between the email and the subject. I will click right here. And into the form menu, there is a couple of buttons. Text, email, URL, tell, number, date, text area, drop down menu. Here is the guide that we're looking for, click on it. Now, here is the menu, it can be a required field or not. And now we need to type the options that you're gonna be able to see right here. You need to apply one option per line, so option one. I'm gonna just copy this to make it faster, okay? So, option two, option three, option four, five, six, and there is this. You can alloy multiple selections or not, so you can let persons select a single option or a couple of options. Insert a blank item into the first option, up to you as well. ID attribute and CSS class in the case that you want to apply code for it, okay? Now, click on insert tag button right here. And here is the result we got. Now I'm gonna get the label, so we can give to this to this section a label, and I'm gonna close the label into the end of the code, just like we did into the other elements. Now, after label, I'm gonna type a name for this field. It can be select 
your option just like this now I'm gonna save my chains and here is the result we got select your option please choose an option and here is the result we got option one two three four five six and can be any kind of option now if someone submit the form you're gonna receive the name the email the option the subject and the message simple easy and very very effective and of course you can customize its location in the case that you want imagine that you would like to have the option after the subject you just need to copy and move it let me do the change here is the result simple right and it is hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to choose the comment section below in the case that you have any question don't forget to check out our borderless plugin to gain widgets elements templates and tools to build up your site using elementor or gutenberg or enzo wordpress team the best free wordpress team that you can install to customize your site in the way that you want or growth.net platform a place where you can promote your blog you can submit your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts or sites.gallery that is a place where you can submit your site app or game to be awarded and promoted and in the case that i want to go premium while doing your site go to visionmoto.com purchase the Vision Moto pass and unlock full access to our entire templates library with hundreds of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click in addition for premium assets blocks templates tools plugins and many many more things to create the side of our dreams and it is hope you guys enjoyed this video and i see you tomorrow all the best